Hello friends and students. In this video segment, we shall see how to add two hex numbers or hexadecimal numbers. In the previous video segments, we have performed octal addition. And if you have gone through that, you will know how to perform hex addition too because it's very similar. Now in hex addition, when we talk about hexadecimal numbers, there are 16 digits varying from 0 to F. So you have numbers 0 to 9 and 10 to 15 is represented by A, B, C, D, E, F. Now during the process of addition, if the number becomes greater than 15, what do you do? We have to convert it to hex format by dividing the given number by 16. Just like how in octal, if the number was greater than 7, we divided it by 8 to get the octal representation. Here, since the base is 16, so we have to divide the given number by 16 if the number is greater than 15. So let's take a few examples and we shall see how to perform hex addition. So in the first case, I need to perform hex addition. I have two numbers, 242 plus 126. Now when I add these two numbers, so none of the digits go beyond 50. So it's a simple addition. So 8 plus 6 plus 2 is 8, 2 plus 4 is 6, 2 plus 1 is 3. Right? So it is 3, 6, 8. So this is hex. So remember all the numbers are hex, hexadecimal numbers. Now if I need to perform addition A, B, C plus D, E, F. So first I need to perform C plus F. Now what is C? C is 12 and F is 15. So when I add both of them I get 27. Right? Now this number 27 is greater than 15 so I have to convert 27 to hex. So what do I do? I divide it by 16. I get 1 as the quotient and I get 11. So therefore 27 decimal is represented as 1 11. 11 is B as hex. So you write B with a 1 carry. Alright, so you write B with a 1 carry. So now I have E plus B plus 1. So B is 11, E is 14 and I have plus 1. So I have 4 plus 1 plus 1 is 6, 2 I have 26. Again divided by 6 I get 1 and 10 here. So this is A. So 26 is nothing but 1A in hex. So I write A with a 1 carry. And then I need to add D plus A plus 1. So A is 10, D is 13 and 1. So I have 4, 2. So divided by 16, I get 1 and 8. Alright? So 8 and 1. Right? 8 and 1. So this is the final hexadecimal result. So when I add ABC with DEF, I get 1, 8, A, B. So this is the answer. So the only thing what you need to remember is when you add two hexadecimal numbers, if the number goes beyond 15, the number is greater than 15, you need to get the hex representation. So how do you get the hex representation? Divide by 16, so you get the hex representation and perform addition as usual. Right? So this is how simple it is. So in this video segment, we have seen how we can perform addition of two hexadecimal numbers. So in the next video segment, we shall see how to subtract hex decimal numbers and how we can also multiply two hex numbers. So do not forget to like, share and subscribe and press the bell icon to get notifications of further uploads. You can also click on the eye icon or go through the playlist Digital Electronics to view all the videos in the topic Digital Electronics. Thanks for watching.